you know, that there's money for certain things, but for like niceties, like, um, you know, nice clothing and a car, things for the house, those are things that you have to save up for. Doing something nice for yourself like that is, you know, you feel guilty about it. Women around the world understand that aging can be difficult and often how they've aged does not reflect who they really are. My name is Lisa Whitaker and I came from Lanesville, Indiana. Beauty is far more than skin deep and often the desire for a makeover comes from the soul of the child within. Um, you know, money's hard to come by. You have to work hard for it. You have to work real hard for it. And if you work hard enough, um, you know, long enough, you're going to attain wealth or, you know, whatever comfort. My dad and mom made a decision when they got married that my mom would be a stay-at-home mom so she could take care of us kids, which we were very blessed. That didn't offer the opportunity of a two-person income. Yeah, we were a one-car family for a long time. You know, that there's money for certain things, but for, like, niceties, like, you know, nice clothing, I guess, you know, a car or just things for the house, you have to save up for. And it's not like just, like, you can go out and buy something. So right. very frugal. That mentality is still there. Doing something nice for yourself like that is, you know, you feel guilty about it. We were a tight-knit family. We didn't have much. When they were married, they were, um, you know, struggling financially. They had me two years after they married, and then they had me, they had my sister, Michelle. I moved a lot when I was a kid. We moved a lot. Start to make friends, and then a couple of years later, we'd move, we'd transfer. My dad was trying to improve, you know, financially. High school was a great experience. But then I went away to college, attending people, so that was gonna be exciting, but I had no idea what I was supposed to do or what I wanted to do, really. And I was homesick, absolutely homesick. And again, with that scarcity mentality that I was living with, I felt I couldn't call home because it was gonna cost money. <laughs> <laughs> didn't have a car and really didn't have friend circle, didn't have familiarity, didn't have any really any goals. It was just kind of like lost, wondering, what am I doing here? Wanted to be in love because that's what you do when you do things that <laughs> you shouldn't be doing. And then became pregnant at 19. It was a blessing because it allowed me to leave the relationship that it was a toxic relationship that I didn't need to be in, absolutely wasn't going to bring a child into. So he was my gift from heaven, my son, John. Well, from that point on, so thankful for my parents because they were uber supportive. And my dad was just like a, a father figure to him until I met my husband, Craig, who well, I'm married to, happily married to now. I'm here just, well, because I've seen work that you guys have done, especially Christopher, and he's done an amazing job bringing out who I think they really are interiorly, and of course exteriorly, it's beautiful. Did you know that Makeover Guy is the first and only company in the world that offers this type of free content? Though we love what we do, we do need you to continue. Just one video like this takes weeks to create. We rely partially on advertising, but our value to the advertisers is based on your engagement interaction in the comments section, and how long you watch the video. Cost of the makeover does not begin to cover expenses, but these women know that and are willing to bear body and soul to help us uplift, inspire, and inform millions like you around the world. So please interact, engage with each other, help us by answering questions you read. If you'd like to say thank you or buy us a cup of coffee, lunch, or whatever you'd like to give, you can do that by clicking the contributions link in the description, and please write a note to let us know your thoughts. We appreciate and honestly, we rely on your contributions to continue. I'm excited to be here. A little nervous, but excited. Um, a lot's happened so far already and I'm looking forward to um, what's to come next. And um, just for the process, I'm looking to feel um, fresh, lighthearted and natural. And now, let's do the big review. I'm so happy to be here. I feel fresh, lighthearted, and natural. <laughs> it was amazing. <laughs> so amazing. So thankful. It was wonderful to see the inside and kind of what I was hoping for and feeling and had been buried for a long time. And it's helped me see that the scarcity mentality I was holding on to is, doesn't serve me anymore and to just reach down deep and to bring forth who you really are. 
I'm just amazed. <laughs> I'm just amazed at the transformation. So very happy. The people that are here are amazing. They know their craft. The more important was the time and attention that they took to find out really who I am. And so that's something that not everyone has that gift or takes the time to do. It's just been a beautiful experience and I just wish that everyone would have the opportunity to come. So if anyone's thinking of coming or just kind of like, well, I'm wondering, absolutely. I would hands down um, hope that everyone would have the opportunity to do this.